Good morning children. I'm Nanti is back again with another interesting project. I hope you will like it. Like you people are studying about animals and plants, right? So I thought uh, let us give it a twist. So the animal prints that is say the skin of the tiger or the leopard or giraffe or the print on the butterfly or the peacock. So I thought of giving these prints a twist. Because I'm sure you must be now bored of making animals and all because you've already done the jungle scene and the underwater scene. So I thought let us give this a twist and these prints I'll teach you how to make on different kind of leaves. So it will be a nice interesting thing a little different like the we, you all know the regular leaves that these are green or purplish or little oranges yellow the autumn leaves so let us now uh, give it a twist and make the leaves with the animal prints so i have uh, taken four of them and uh, you watch the video uh, try making the leaves with the prints of your choice not necessary that i have made the four prints that i have made you need to take those only so you can take any other prints of the birds feather you can take different kinds of butterflies are there you can take that peacock like i have taken and zebra giraffe leopard tiger whichever you want you can take that and let us uh, recreate leaves of our own prints so just uh, come on let us start making and see how it comes out so let us begin by designing our own leaves and patterns you can also do one thing that you can take the actual leaves and trace the shape of this only but uh, i'll like draw the shapes on my own so for that first thing we have to do just let us make it a little artistic a little uh, abstract you can say so i'll be taking four circles so i'm making this means that i'm making four leaves now for circles you can take any bowl or any cup and i'll just uh, make the circles like this with very light hand and then i'll show you how to place the leaves fine so here my four circles are done if you want you can place them in different order i am doing it like this again the placement of circles or any other shape is your choice now what i was thinking that whichever leaf i make i'll cross it over the circle so that it looks a little artistic so now if first leaf suppose i start from here now i like i said i'm i'll be taking butterfly peacock giraffe and tiger these four uh, animals or uh, sorry this butterfly and all i'll be taking and i'll just take the patterns of those and make them on the leaf right so now i have selected these four you can select any other four that you want now, now suppose if i uh, wish to make a leaf here with the pattern of you can say a uh, giraffe or a peacock so i am thinking as peacock has got those round round coin like shape so what i'll do the leaf that i'll take is this shape so for the shape for the pattern of the peacock i am taking this kind of leaf as i need circles over here so i am just making this leaf over here now i have crossed this circle so now afterwards what we'll do once i have decided which shape i wish to make i'll do that and then i'll rub this okay now second uh, i wish to take the tiger print on this leaf so from here i'll make it this side so one leaf this way one i'll make here and i'll just make the leaf a little long as the tiger print has got uh, stripes so long leaf will be able to adjust the tiger print 
now these patterns these uh, different types of leaves i am making but if you want you can do this pattern on the flowers also and you can make nice uh, paintings and all artwork that can be like you can hang in your uh, drawing room or in your bedroom they will look nice a different art piece or you can just um, if you know how to uh, paint on the piece of cloth you can just make one flower and you can make it into a tiger print or any other animal print that you want and you can just make new art pieces for yourself so now because the tiger print is a long print so i have taken this kind of leaf now if i find later that they are a little big you can always play with the size you can reduce here right if you find they are a little big you can just tilt them left right according to you now here i'll be making a leaf which will have the butterfly print so this leaf i'll bring it down that means the top part the point of the leaf would be here and for that i'm taking this kind of leaf for the butterfly print okay like this and now the last one so that i'll make a little small here and i'll make it look like the maple leaf right kind of maple leaf i'm just designing a new shape of the leaf with the help of this circle right so these are the four kind of leaves that i am taking and i'll be making the prints on this every time just drawing the basic uh, animals or the typical green leaves the way we have becomes a little boring so let us be a little adventurous and try and make a little different art piece so when you have different leaves and different patterns it will look nice you can uh, pick one and paint it on a scarf or a mat or something or a small coasters on paper you can make so you these all techniques you can use in different things also so now i am done with this and now i'll show you that what we have to do next it is we will rub this these lines that are crossing the leaves here okay and now i'll start to make the print now see first is the peacock thing that we have now you have got two options you can make the peacock here and if you want you can make the it here also both will look nice so for the peacock thing we'll start from here those big circles like this and whatever is extra overlapping you can always rub so now for this uh, peacock one i have just expanded this shape in the shape of the leaf only i have added this you can add one circle over here because the peacock feathers are very pretty so let us try and make them pretty and i'll just extend this stem because the stem of the uh, peacock feather is a long one and here we can later add these small feather part like the way we have in the peacock one now as you can see some print i have already made this is the tiger print so i am just making these lines that will do like the tiger print you can make it a zebra look like a zebra zebra lines you can make you can make it a leopard like this 
so these are your creations like you can design your different leaves different flowers and all so here is the kind of tiger print right now let us come to this as um, we thought of converting this into a butterfly so it has to be same both the sides right here and I'll just make the same line again I'll repeat here like this so both sides we get same pattern like we have in the butterfly thing here it is right now this we were converting into the giraffe so again here if you wish you can remove this line here just let it be on the outer part so that you get space for making the pattern like the giraffe now again while when we'll start coloring we'll be having two options either we do them in the shades of green only or we do them in the colors like this is giraffe so in the uh, color same as the giraffe so this is the other thing that we will decide once we get down to coloring right now so we are just drawing the pattern so see art can be so many things it is not necessary that the actual flower that you make it that is only art art can be so many different things and interesting also so it is always good to just reimagine the thing that okay god has made the leaves like this let us try and make them a little different so that you have new techniques to learn and you have new things to draw and you don't get bored so this is the drawing and this is your work for this time this week you will be doing the drawing part and we'll continue with the coloring uh, later on so this is the work for you just uh, see what leaves what prints you want and then accordingly design your sheet okay